It's been an active week for the Miami Dolphins, as they've brought in and retained a number of free agents to get their roster ready for 2022 and beyond. On Tuesday, however, Miami lost their second free agent this offseason, as center Greg Mance agreed to a deal with the Buffalo Bills, according to ESPN, Dan Graziano. The other free agent the Dolphins lost was Mac Hollins, who signed with the Las Vegas Raiders. Mance, 29 was traded to the Dolphins from the Baltimore Ravens, along with a seventh-round pick, for a sixth-round pick. He served as the backup center until Michael Dieter went down, forcing Mance to step up. The former Toledo Rockets started four games but suffered an injury of his own that pushed Austin Ryder into the starting job. At this point, the Dolphins only have Dieter for center options, so they'll likely need to add another through free agency or the draft. After signing former Miami Dolphins center Greg Mance on Monday morning, the Buffalo Bills have signed another free agent from Miami. According to ESPN's Adam Schefter, running back Duke Johnson is joining the Bills on a one-year deal. Johnson, 28, joined Miami practice squad roughly midway through the 2021 season after spending just over a week on the Jacksonville Jaguars practice squad in September. When Johnson finally got the opportunity to step on the field, he was productive, rushing for 330 yards and three touchdowns on 4.6 yards per carry. He added another 41 yards on four receptions in the receiving game. The Dolphins have already signed Chase Edmonds and Raheem Mostert this offseason, so once those moves were made, it was pretty unlikely that Johnson would return for a second season.